Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to find the volume of a triangular pyramid. And remember, volume is the amount of space that a 3D figure or object takes up. Now when it comes to pyramids, we can use the formula 1 3rd times the area of the base times the height. So whatever the base is, a rectangle, a square, in the case of this video, a triangle, find the area of that base using the correct formula and then plug that area into the formula for the volume. I do want to mention that you can use the formula the area of the base times the height divided by 3 because multiplying by 1 third and dividing by 3 will give you the same thing. So let's jump into our example where we have a triangular pyramid with a height of 10 inches. And the first thing that we want to do is write out our formula. So volume equals 1 third times the area of the base times the height. Now we plug in. So volume equals 1 third. Now we need to calculate the area of the base. So this triangular base right here. And we're going to go off to the side in order to calculate this. So we can use the formula area equals 1 half times the base times the height. Or you can do base times height divided by 2. Multiplying by a half or dividing by 2, they will get you the same answer. So let's plug in our base of the triangle and the height. So 1 half times the base, which is 7 inches, times the height of 8 inches. So we know that 7 times 8 is 56. So let's break this down here and we'll do 1 half times 56 or 1 half of 56 and that gives us an area of 28. So the area of the base is 28 square inches. So let's plug that in times the height of 10 inches. And now we're ready to solve here. So 1 third times 28 times 10, that's going to give us the volume of this triangular pyramid. So let's break this down and we'll do 28 times 10 first. 28 times 10 is going to give us 280. And we'll wrap this up with 1 third times 280 or 1 third of 280. And that gives us a final volume of 93. And I'm going to round this decimal to the nearest hundredth. So 33 hundredths. And this is volume, so cubic inches. So our final volume, 93 and 33 hundredths cubic inches. And again, I rounded that decimal to the nearest hundredth. Now I'm also going to solve this using the other formula the area of the base times the height divided by three. Essentially, both of those are the same thing. Remember, multiplying by one third and dividing by three will get you the same thing, but I'll set it up to show you how that works as well. So we will write out our formula. So area of the base times the height divided by three. Now we plug in. So the area of the base, well, we said that was 28. We already solved for that times the height of 10, and divide that by 3. So we end up with 28 times 10 is 280. Divide that by 3 to get our final answer of the same thing, 93. And again, I'm rounding to the hundredths place, 33. And I'll put my unit of measure underneath because I'm running out of room here. So 93 and 33 hundredths cubic inches. So there you have it. There's how you find the volume of a triangular pyramid. One third times the area of the base times the height, or the area of the base times the height divided by three. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.